Hey guys, we finally got some sunshine here in Ohio, so I wanted to show you guys how this death ray I was talking about the other day works. And so, what we've got is a satellite dish, I just put some reflective tape on it, so it's basically going to reflect all the rays of the sun. And what we know about parabolas is when everything hits this paraboloid of revolution, basically just a parabola that we took and made 3D by wrap, like basically going around in a circle. Um, and when everything bounces off of that reflective surface, it's all going to focus onto one specific point we call the focus and if we do that with the sun we can actually get some really cool results so here we're going to try this with a couple things and see what happens so this is just a piece of paper and I'll probably have to mess around with it for a second to find the focus but you'll know exactly when I do and there it is uh, as you can see there it goes. Uh, so it doesn't take long if you concentrate the rays of the sun to get that to burn. There you go. Here, we'll try it with a piece of wood too. Um, see what happens here. Just the right point. There it is. And as you can see, you might have been able to hear it even. That's already on fire. And there we go. We burnt the end off of that. Uh, <clears throat> so there's actually some cool stuff that, that you can do with this that has some practical purpose. Um, one is solar panels. The really expensive part of solar collection is the panels themselves. So if you could take the cost out of having all these solar panels to collect things and instead just concentrate the sun onto one panel, that would save a lot of money. And this is actually done in some solar collection facilities. They just have huge parabolic reflectors. And instead of having a whole bunch of panels, they have one panel that takes all that collection um, and then it all goes to that point. Um, and kind of an interesting story, they've actually had to put nets over them because birds were becoming flaming projectiles in the sky if they would fly through the focus. Um, so after they killed a few birds on accident, they realized that they needed to net these because, um, as you can see, the focus of one of these, even this small, becomes very hot. If you made a huge one of these, if something just moved through the focus, it just kind of instantly would set it ablaze. Um, and so that's one practical use of this. There's some others, but I uh, just thought I'd show you guys that. I thought it was pretty cool. Um, don't try this at home, um, or at least if you do, then I'm not responsible for any results that happen. All right, see you guys.